you know, uh, my music teacher said to me, you'll never get anywhere because you look like a goat. But, um, oh, no! <laughs> you know, it's, doing that not, it's not held me back. Um, You're a lovely lady. Face, so are you. Yeah. You're gorgeous. Now, oh, we're getting on well here, aren't we? <laughs> now, um, when did your dad first realise that you had a gift for singing? I remember this moment vividly, actually. We were going to the beach with my mom. We were in the car and we were all singing. And my dad looked at my mom and said, listen, listen, listen to our daughter's voice. She's very, it's very powerful. It's very potente in Spanish, you know, I don't know, potent, I guess is the word in English. Yeah. Powerful. And, and that word that I didn't even know what it meant back then, because I was probably four or five years old, it stuck to my head forever, you know. Potente, oh, I have a voice which is very powerful. And uh, I guess that, was, that, was, that meant a lot to me, and I still, I still uh, keep and treasure those, those words. Yeah, they're fantastic, um, those, those yeah. um, he incidents He definitely life, planted a, a seed in, my, in, my, in, my, in me that, that later on bloomed in, in some kind of way. And, but they, they were always very encouraging. Now, uh, what I was reading about, I was particularly interested in, is your foundation. Um, because um, over in this country, we do take education for granted, but it's not like that in Colombia, is it? Yeah, in countries like mine, uh, and in the developing world in general, um, sometimes and sadly, education is considered a luxury and not a birthright, like it should be. Only a few people have access to, to, to the right kind of education. Um, and we all know that, that there are millions of kids around the world who don't have any access to any kind of education. 70 million kids actually don't have access to, to any kind of uh, primary school education. So um, since I was 18 years old, I decided to establish my foundation in Colombia to provide high quality education for kids um, and to build schools in areas where there, there have been for, for, for many years a lack of presence I think from the government. I think from an 18-year-old, that is absolutely amazing. You've all, yeah, it's incredible. You've, um, you've already helped thousands and thousands of kids, haven't you? And, and I think what's so fantastic about it is it actually gives the kids their childhood back, really, Absolutely. doesn't it? Absolutely, and their hopes in life to become, to become productive members of society, to, to have a dignified future. I think that education is, is really the, the one key that we, we, can, we can use to unlock every child's potential. Well, I just think they're enormously thankful that they've got someone like you on their side. Um, mm. Now, do you, th do you think anyone can learn to move their hips like you? Absolutely, yeah. I'm slightly elderly <laughs> and arthritic. I'm virtually <laughs> dead, really. But will you, will you give me a little lesson in, in how to dance like you and move my Why hips? Why don't you show me your, your potential? I'll show you. <laughs> show me what you got. <laughs> I've been told that I have to put this on. I borrowed it off Kate Moss. Um, <laughs> mm, ladies and gentlemen, yes, I know, it's don't a do the obligatory color. whistling. It's beautiful. How attractive is that? <laughs> OK, so if I have a go and you'll tell me if I'm doing the right thing or not. Hit me. OK. <laughs> I have that... nothing to teach you. Oh, <laughs> you sweet woman. <laughs> so, so I like so... that. <laughs> yes. That was I perfect. I'm, I'm working on it. You're a good Absolutely. dancer. Absolutely. I'm not a good dancer. Yeah, it's very seriously. sweet of you to say. <laughs> but, ladies and gentlemen, it's been such a joy. Let's hear it, <laughs> Thank please. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> well, Shakira, <laughs> Sorry. Would you like to get married? I would love to get married. <laughs> <laughs> that tie is working on me. Are you married? Uh, no, I'm semi-married. Semi. What does that mean? <laughs> it's very convenient, I can tell you that. I'll just do my knitting. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. <laughs>
does your reputation as a ladies' man put some girls off? God forbid, I can't imagine that it would. What do you think, Shakira? Sorry, sorry? Does his reputation... He has a reputation as a ladies' man. <laughs> it's hard to tell. I can tell. I mean, I should have been warned about this before the, the Has that put you off? The show. Doesn't seem to have done. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Shakira. <laughs> no, I'm only asking. Does it you put you off? No. Wonderful. Are you single at the moment? Well, I've actually just met a really lovely girl. Oh, damn. He's met Another a really one, lovely huh? girl. Yeah. No, she's lovely, so um, oh, I'm please. really hoping it works out. Um, yeah. So you're saying yes. I'm married now? Well, um... <laughs> No, I mean, <laughs> no, no, I've just, I only met her recently, so we'll see what happens. I and mean, it was literally in the last sort of five or ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Did anything, what is on there? I've forgotten. <laughs> is that Shakira's picture that or was mine? Shakira. I is wasn't kissing my own picture. <laughs> 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 I might do. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> mm, you're lovely. 